hey guys welcome back if you're new my name is bianca welcome to the vlog in today's vlog i'm actually super super nervous to be completely honest so basically long story short i got this opportunity sent my way i'm in this group chat on instagram and one of the girls on the group chat was like we need a model for fillers or botox does anyone want to be a model i know it's super last minute but this is a day and luckily i had had the day off from work so i decided to volunteer to be the Model. so today I am going to go get lip fillers I actually just got into the city right now I just parked my car and the whole entire car ride I've just been so anxious so nervous like palm sweaty Ooh, like I don't know why I'm so scared I'm like not a needle person at all so I feel like just a needle being around my face is gonna be so scary but I just did want to put a disclaimer out there I don't think that I need lip fillers I love my lips I am comfortable in my skin I am the one to preach like being all natural this this and this the reason why I took this opportunity was because I definitely wanted to experience this I wanted to see what it was about I wanted to give it a try just so I know what lip fillers is about and I could say that I've tried it in my lifetime but yeah I do love my lips I'm excited to see how they're gonna look and yeah let's just get right to it guys let's walk over I'm like so fucking anxious and nervous I couldn't even like sleep last night because I kept on just thinking about it it was just it was intense as fuck. We're here, we made it, we're getting it done. I don't really know where to go. Got my Fiji water. I got a GPS this, a three minute walk. It's right around the corner. Let's do this. Oh fuck. They almost just left without paying the meter. I would have gotten a fat ticket. I don't know, maybe like an hour and a half. So, the girl that actually sent this message out in the group chat is gonna be here as well. And she's also getting her lips done. So I'm super excited. Oh, it's so freezing, guys. Definitely not dressed for the weather. My stomach is completely out, but it's okay. YOLO. Let's do this. Okay. And then just put your name and then sign, and then I will find you. Your turn. <laughs> hey. Yay. Guys, we're getting down and dirty. I just wiped my lips with this alcohol. Introduce oh yourself. God. Oh, hey, I'm Kate. <laughs> You can follow my Instagram, KateCasado underscore. You know it. This is my first time ever being in a vlog. <laughs> doing great, doing great. We're just rubbing our lips with alcohol, guys. To start this process off. She's like YouTube and Instagram famous. Just aspiring over here. <laughs> I'm so scared, guys. I'm really nervous, but it's okay. We're gonna do this. The alcohol pad. <laughs> Feels weird, but mm -hmm. we can't feel anything. anything. <laughs> I got it in my mouth, so mm. that's great. <laughs> had a top lip like i feel like you can't really tell on me i don't know is it just me from the side profile you can tell i feel like they look a little bit uneven right now but like they said it's gonna take a few days to a week to like settle down and be their true form so right now they feel like a little dry a little bumpy but and still numb yeah and still numb but they're gonna settle down in a week or two and then we're gonna go in for a touch up and they will be the most perfect that they'll ever be yes guys i'm really happy same we got so nauseous so i both, literally both of us 
we both had to sit down because we both got so nauseous and I, I like, thought I was gonna pass out guys yeah. like my vision went blurry my ears were tingling I had to drink some serum mist so didn't she oh my god like I was sitting there and I was fine like the first time she went in with the needle but then after that right the, the second, second one time, the I was second like one sweating same I was literally profusely sweating I was sweating so bad I literally thought like I peed my pants like, I was <laughs> Sweating, like, hella sweating every yeah. before my body. Same, same. Oh. We're right in front of the bridge. We're right in the hub of everything. It's such a perfect day, honestly, to just be out, chilling, walking around. Just to enjoy the city, you know? I feel like it's cold out, but the sun's out, and yeah. the sky is like, doesn't have one cloud. And there's dogs. And there's dogs! <laughs> like, literally. How cute. <sighs> but we're going back to the car. Because so we're just heading to CVS because our lips are literally dry <laughs> as all hell. Like there was so much wiping with alcohol that my lips literally feel so dry. And I think, ooh, puppy. <laughs> take, take a left. We made it. We made it to seaport. My lips feel like that episode of SpongeBob where his lips just crumple off because they're so dry. No, seriously, that's us right now. And we cannot put on, like, I brought chapstick with me. They told me I can't use it. So we get, we're going into CVS to get We gotta new, get new chapstick. New, new. So there's no bacteria collecting on it. Yes. <laughs> to the CVS. We go straight to the makeup aisle. Like, we need chapstick. We have chapstick, you know? You just never know. Vaseline never does me dirty. And there's some jackpot. Yes, to so the 100% natural and organic. I think I'm gonna get this Eos one. It's sweet mint. Strawberry peach, that sounds kind of fire. What one's that one? Is that a coconut? A vanilla bean. And we have this one. We're matching. And today we'll be trying the Eos. <laughs> All Lip natural and 100% organic. Is it vegan? Oh yeah. <laughs> and natural shea butter. I have shea butter in my hair, it's unreal. I don't know if I really like their chapstick that much though. Make sure if you get your lips filled, just go get a chapstick before. Because then you're gonna be in the situation like us that we're literally dying. Scurrying for chapstick. Like, who does this? Us. <laughs> but I didn't know you need something new. I literally brought my own chapstick. Same. Because so my lips look like crazy now. But like in a good way. Yeah. <laughs> good. First, we need some chapstick. It came off. <laughs> oh, this is kind of sick. I'm just casually putting them in chapstick. Well, my lips feel so weird. It feels so weird doing this. It feels weird putting on the chapstick. No, like rubbing them together. We both just got our lips done for the first time. We're both like freaking out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's what we're like. We need chapstick. It, was, um, my it feels so felt. weird. It feels so weird. Making friends wherever we go. No big deal. But Put it on, like, girl. Like making the kissy face. Right. It feels so weird. Anymore? Oh shit, it's green. Oh, shit. It's green. <laughs> we you look literally it? don't give a fuck. We're like just talking, vlogging, like here the whole green light. <laughs> Oh wow, yeah, that does feel fucking weird. Right? I like love them though. Cause they like look like my lips, but like better. And like that's what we were going for. I'm glad that she like didn't have to do too much to either of us. I feel like a lot of people too, they just want like a little bit extra. They don't want to look fake. Right. Like that look isn't cute anymore. Like we both loved our lips before this. Yeah. Neither one of us needed our lips done. We were oh, literally we walked by. <laughs> <laughs> we made it. Heavy ass door. Still got the chapstick in my hand. <laughs> so yummy. I tried it like a few weeks ago. It's so good. It's like a chicken parm. I think I'm gonna do the chicky chicky, but it's gonna be so hard eating a sandwich. She took her trial because she's a good girl. I don't care. I'm just gonna use the side of my mouth. <laughs> I'm using it like this. I'm doing it like this. <laughs> it's really hard. It works. Damn, what's That's how I'm gonna be smoking too. <laughs> it's lunch date. It's, it's gonna be a good time. You can have some of these too. I'm not gonna eat you them You are the best. <laughs> Girl, I'm so hungry. Literally. How, on a scale of one to ten, how hard is it? It's so uncomfortable. 
makes me so happy, guys. This is so good. Mm -hmm. So hard to eat. Mm -hmm. Oh damn it. It's just uncomfortable. It's not that bad though. Mm -hmm. And you can just feel like your lips. Yeah, you can feel how like there's shit in there. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers, guys. We did it. I feel like Trisha paid us on like a thing or some shit. <laughs> I'm so happy to eat them. Same. It feels so good. I feel hella swollen. them. All right, guys. We're gonna finish eating, and we'll be back, guys. That food at the spot. I have Holy a little food. lonely chicken left, but so good. I'm still eating. I feel like I'm eating so slow. <laughs> Like my lips can't do it right now. I know. It's a lot of work and then like you forget about it and you make one like little movement and you're like, oh shit, what mm -hmm. was that? But we just finished eating. Oh I did, she's still eating. <laughs> I think I'm gonna tap out soon. Show you. So I just dropped Kat off at the train station and uh, we had a very fun, productive day. I feel like Eat by Chloe's was absolutely amazing. And we got some pictures and some content for her out in Seaport. So yeah, I just dropped off at the train station and now I'm on my way back home. So Abish is about to just jam out, enjoy this hour car ride back home. My lips are definitely filling out a bit more. I can notice it a lot in my lower lip. I love them. Such a vibe. I'm like literally vlogging and in this Boston traffic at the same time. I don't think it's the best idea. So I'm gonna hop off, but I'll see you guys when I get home. So I just got home and I'm in front of my vanity mirror lighting so you can actually see my lips and i am so obsessed with them guys like i didn't think that they would look this different and just make such a difference to my face but like yes so freaking good they are a little swollen still and they still need to like fully not like dissolve but they fully need to like sit into my lips so you can see like a little bit of the lump still but they're gonna eventually like fully be healed into my lips and they won't really look like that anymore but not bad on the bruising i just have a little bruise right here and i think that's honestly about it i don't really see any other bruising forming maybe just a tiny bit here but nothing too crazy i will say that my lips have been super chapped since getting them done but i've just been applying a ton of chapstick and just trying to maintain the hydration of them but like I said I'm obsessed I feel like you can tell that I got them done but like you can't it's like does she have them done does she not I will definitely be updating you guys um I'll update you guys tomorrow for a full day update so around like 3 p.m I'll hop on here for a full day update and then I will do like a week update I think I'm going back in two weeks to get the other half of the syringe put in and just kind of seeing where my lips are at um at that point but yes guys i made it through it was freaking a crazy journey i got so lightheaded at one point and i had to just like sit back for a second but made it through now that i know what the pain level is and what to expect and i've experienced it i feel like i feel a lot better about the situation but yeah i'm excited to see where my lips are at in two weeks and go from there but i think i'm gonna head out right now go hang out with some friends but i'll see you guys tomorrow for a check-in all right guys so it's been a little bit less than 24 hours since i've had my lips done they are super swollen right now because i just woke up not too long ago and they say that the second day they're the most swollen so i was expecting them to be bigger than they were yesterday but yeah i just wanted to hop on here and kind of just update you guys i'm about to go to the gym and get a little bit of a workout in i woke up feeling a little bit of discomfort in my lips obviously like there's foreign objects in my lips right now but no bruising really i think i just have a tiny little bruise right here other than that they look like really really good like i thought i was going to be bruised so much more just because it's my first time but no bruising really they're just really really swollen and really freaking big but they're gonna go down a little bit so i'm not too worried yes i'm gonna go to the gym and i'll hop back on here when i get back so guys 
I kind of suck at the whole vlogging a few days later type of situation. It's been exactly a week and a half since I've gotten my lips done. And this is how they look. I feel like they definitely have settled down a lot. They don't look as dramatic. Sorry about my bed not being made in the back. I literally just washed all my bed sheets, so I just have to actually make my bed now. Yeah, this is how they look. I didn't get to vlog myself with makeup on, but don't worry. Stay tuned for future videos because you guys will see me with makeup on for sure with my lips done. I just feel like it was more of an enhancement to my lips more so than like a big dramatic change. But like I said, I am going back on Friday or maybe even a few days after Friday to get a touch up and get the other half of the syringe put in. I think I wanna get the majority of the other half on the upper part of my lip and just get more of like that like top lip flip. I'm very, very, very happy with how they came out. The only thing that I will say is that I don't know if you guys can notice it on on camera but I have this little like bump right here I'm not really sure if it's from the filler or what or if it's gonna go away but um yeah that's the only thing it's really not even that noticeable it's just something that I kind of noticed I'm hoping with the second time around that that will be fixed but yeah I'm super super happy with how they came out let me know what you guys think about them in the comments down below I actually went and got my nails done yesterday for my nail tech and she had no idea that I got them done and I told her and she's like wow I couldn't even tell I was like they still look very very natural to me which I absolutely love because I never had a problem with my lips to begin with. This was like a trial run for you guys. Just something to like film and it was an opportunity so I took it. And I think it was a pretty good experience. The journey's not over yet so stay tuned for the second part of this vlog. It'll be like an update on the lip fillers when I go again. Thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. If you guys liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you guys aren't already subscribed to my channel, you guys know the deal. Subscribe and until next time, I'll see you guys all on my next video and I love you guys all so much. Thank you for the support.